Hey everybody, I hope you all enjoyed your holidays, Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever you celebrate, we don't judge here on this channel. So, as promised, I'm going to be finishing The Incredibles today, as well as continuing along with Final Fantasy VII Remake. Houston, we have a problem. What is it? Okay, sure, this is actually an interesting thing to do. This is the very same cutscene that started off the last mission. The the but good. obviously, we're going to be playing it from yeah, Bob's perspective yeah. now. Make your way to the rocket. Don't I've seen caught. plenty of other games and TV right shows now. do that, so... After you, huh? It's not a bad idea. Yeah, she runs off instead of him, so he's the one left in the room. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. So avoiding the spotlight is not even possible. Whoa! Oh, this is Ambush Hallway! Wait a minute. I only hit two of these missiles, so did these two shoot each other? I guess that's what happened, because I only hit two of these things. That's amazing. This is less amazing. And of course, they're all wearing their super armor. See, why can't the grab attack work when I want it to? Yeah. Hey, they are shooting their own guys! How is that I didn't notice that until now that you can shoot, they can shoot each other? I think... No, I think we've seen that. They're not going to make this easy for me if I leave them here to shoot at me. Fine. Ow, what the... Are you kidding me? Just as I say finally, too. Look at that. I lost almost half my health just from trying to take these guys out. Thankfully, there's a health pack right there, as if the game developers knew, hey, make sure you leave a pack there, or else the players will get pissed. I know I brought this up before, but I love the music in this game. Can I smack one out the air? No. Okay, so what do I do here, game? Oh, you know what? Okay, I know what I have to do. Probably gotta activate all these things. And hopefully they don't move until I jump on them. Yeah, it looks like they're staying there until I go. Oh, okay, you know what? Let me take this one first. Because part of me thinks like, okay, I should be able to swing from those things hanging up or hanging off of there. So let's see what happens when I activate these. Ah, uh ah. -huh. What does this one do? Sweet. Alright, let's roll. going off way better than the oh shit. another ambush yep okay again I didn't punch this one they keep shoot each other Man, they really want to make sure I can't get through it's a good thing I went through this hallway and not last a girl Cause I guess you could like. Oh, hey, it's the old, old robot arena. Screw this. Is this 
try to throw it at its friend, but I couldn't get a lock on him. Okay, these things are just gonna keep spawning, so I gotta, well, I gotta move. Okay, I have three points again. How do I get up there? Ah. Okay. Woo! -hoo -hoo. That was a good dodge. Really? Hey, there's, there's gotta be something I can do here. Are you fucking kidding? I was gonna say, why would I want to destroy that? Okay, I cleared them, but... Wait, back up again? Oh, you gotta be fast as shit. Problem is, this other platform isn't working. Like, this other, uh. Maybe it's not working. Like, see, I'm not even getting the prompt. I'm not supposed to hit that one first. Okay. This is already getting kind of annoying right now. The only thing I can really activate was that one. Okay, hang on, guys. Just you don't see me wandering around for another, like, ten minutes. Okay, so... I've been wondering... Oh my god, something's finally happening! So wait, I was supposed to defeat all those enemies and then this guy pops up? Well, why didn't the game give me a message telling me to defeat all the enemies? I was running around here for the last ten minutes being confused as all hell. Whoa! Damn! I have to jump that too. This is already going to be a more annoying to fight because of how. Ooh. Because of how small the room is. There's barely any room to maneuver. Oh, yeah. You have to use the bombs on him. Because these little blue things just sitting around here are not strong enough to hurt him. Why is it never easy? Yeah, should have saw that coming. Wait for it. Ha! Oh. No, that hit me. Yep, I did that way too early. You know, I wasn't expecting them to make another Kung Fu Panda movie, but I'm actually- Oh my god, they tried to combo me! His second bomb blew me forward as his shockwave tried to send me right back. I never thought the Incredibles game would be where I get the most combos done on myself. What hit me there? I love when the game gives me hit. No, takes hits that I definitely didn't take. Okay, so now the console's activated. Again, they should have told me to eliminate all the enemies. I kept activating the other console thinking there was something wrong because of the game crash. I was so close to killing myself just so I can restart the checkpoint. Because again, saving the checkpoint just means, you know, getting to the next checkpoint just means that, oh, when you die, you start at that checkpoint. If you try to leave the level and come back, you have to start the whole level over again. Yeah, okay, I get it now. I'm supposed to jump. No, I got that. I just couldn't get the angle right because we were constantly spinning. I mean, look at my health bar, though. Okay. Woo! Wait for it. Alright. I don't have the best angles! Dang it! I just need to do what I did with Elastic Girl and just jump immediately. The swinging back and forth just messes up the angle. Because once again, they are rotating. So. 
dang it! Oh, it was so close! Alright, one last try. I should have just went for the next, uh, swinging point rather than trying to jump for the platform. That was my own fault. Yeah, see? You just barely get enough. I'm not even all that mad because this feels like a lot more me than the game, but still. Yeah, I could have probably made that. I'm just second guessing myself now. Oh, come on! I'm about to cut in a second. So now this is starting to annoy me. Look at this. I'm 11 minutes into the recording, I only hit one checkpoint. Up there. But I'm not getting much further by swinging back and forth. Well, I am, but it's just taking a lot longer. Okay, no, don't go for the platform yet. Go for this. Now the platform. Yes! And now it's the second checkpoint, thank God. How long is level gonna be? Well, if they keep doing shit like that, it's gonna take a good while. Alright, come on. There we go. Oops. I'm gonna die in this hallway, just watch. There a move you could do to follow up him like uppercut people in the air. I gotta try that. I wonder if that's a fact. Why is it something up and throw them, but... There we go. Down here. Whoa. Should have figured there'd be something hidden behind there. This one? Get this little platform. Uh, ooh, ooh. I almost ran face first into that. Okay, seriously, what did that one do? I don't see any. Oh. No, I still can't activate that yet. Moving all that help I just got. Oh my god, he sunk into the floor. Damn you. Dude, this feels like one of those rooms where I have to defeat all the enemies again. Really? My fist connected with him, but it didn't register a hit. These guys are the worst. Okay, I think they're just gonna keep spawning, so I need to come up with a different strategy here. See, ah, uh, out of here. Yeah, they're gonna keep stopping. Alright. Well, what else is there for me to do here? I've already taken like, what, three, four waves of these falling enemies? 
And there's no other switches for me to hit other than this one right here, but it's not activated. Or... Whoa! Like, how... I can't avoid everything. This is so annoying. Like, I can either just pick up and throw things at them or punch them at the air. Come on, game. Why do you do this? Why do you do stuff like this and not tell me? Like, I'm just running around like a jackass. Hang on, guys. I need to figure this out. Okay, no crap. No shit at all. The second I pause the recording, I go back to the game to investigate. Now, this console wants to activate. After, like, what? Five waves. Look at my health bar. See, see, the developers knew these two levels were going to be bullshit. Because they have health literally... Oh, no. Not here. Miss. See, look, there's health and incredible power down here. Oh, oh no. The swarm is back. And unlike the enemies that are, like, uh, sitting on the ground, you get, like, no indication when these guys are about to fire. They'll just turn and shoot you like they're, like they're Call of Duty quicks, like they're Call of Duty quickscoping or something. See, with these guys, you can hear them talking their guns. Alright, now it's itself. Yeah, because this is just meant to be a gauntlet. Got up, didn't he? Yep. Part of me wants to get a webcam for these videos, because you should see my face when I experience them as bullshit. that Mr. Incredible can't jump when he's carrying things. Like, I get have, I get things that are, like, two-handed. You probably don't want him jumping. But something like a bomb, you should be able to jump with a bomb. Heck, if Murray from Sly Cooper can jump while carrying things with both of his hands, then Mr. Incredible definitely should be able to. think that they would have something like that in the game since most of the moves oh, yeah. most of the game is dedicated to playing as Mr. Incredible. Smash. Thought I was gonna have to roll into that. Try my best to keep running around because uh he likes to close in on me sometimes to do a shockwave attack. Go on, do your fire already. What's going on? Oh. Like, it couldn't be the fact that he was trying to get, like, a good shot on me, because you guys see how much that arcs. Come on. Yeah. I can't stand these boss fights personally, just because they go so slow. If there was more than one way to hurt him... Oh, are you kidding me? Another one! This is literally a marathon. I don't remember this level at all. I don't remember it being this tedious, at least. 
we're already 20 minutes in, and I'm only halfway through the level. Ah! Yeah, I was gonna go for a walk at nine. And it's currently uh, eight fourteen as I'm recording. So, with my luck, by the time I get this level done and the final mission done, it'll be nine o'clock. <laughs> I was not expecting this. Look, well, we are near the end, but I wasn't expecting it to be this tedious. Come on, you're gonna do the flames or what? Why are you? So slow on doing the flame attack. I don't get it. Why is it never easy? Because again, it can't be because he's trying to get face to face with me, because that's stupid. You see how much this fire arcs. Like if I don't jump, it's going to hit me. Uh bye. Oh, incredible. Come on. Oh, of course. Of course. Yes, that's exactly what I wanted the game to do. Thank you, game. Thank you for properly taking what I wanted to do and doing it effectively. I love you. Again, slow with the... It's like it wants to wait for me to be directly in front of it before shooting the flamethrower. Can we get final? Oh, yeah. If there's a third one, I'm gonna scream. Try. Oh, thank God. Let's get out of here. Look at this. And it's not even the green or the yellow's health, which you guys know heals a lot less. I'm getting nothing but red health around here. I guess that lowered that platform. Wait. What was the point of coming in here? We're just gonna leave right back out. Oh, because now that door's open. That hits me, I swear. Okay. Because sometimes, you guys know this because if you play, especially if you're gamers, the cutscene could have ended too early, and then that rocket would have hit me, and I could have done nothing about it. Huh? Now what? Don't tell me to take these guys out again. Just don't make it easy. God. See, why don't you have Elastigirl with all these fly enemies? At least she can just grab them out the air or punch them out the air. Now it's activated. Okay. Oh God. What? He wouldn't let me jump there for a second, despite the fact that I was pressing A. Jesus Christ. This game always wants to get me close to killing me, but never actually does it. Well, in this particular level, I should say. I've died a couple of times. Like that. See, it's like you gotta be in the perfect position to do that finishing grab. It's really irksome. Big tanks. Oh my god, Jesus, look at all this. Oh. 
Oh, great. My favorite section of the game. Uh, this level hates me. Thankfully, I've, I've remembered the crappy control, so it's not nearly as bad. I just need to get this last one out of the air. There we go. Like Can't lie, it's kind of better to shoot all these guys rather than trying to fight them with my cut. But still, that does not mean I like the turn section. See, yeah, you can't keep those out the air. That's not. Try. Wait, what? It skipped the animation and replayed it again. Oh, of course. I can't get the turret for the giant robot, but I can get it for all the human enemies that I could have just punched. Uh, Pardon me, starting to think that maybe the developers, uh, Ran out of ideas by this point. Because I'm literally just fighting a gauntlet of enemies now. And what's sad is, or not sad, but terrifying, is that I really do not remember how the, the last level of this game goes. I think they do something with the remote. My syndrome keeps on his wrist. But other than, and I think the Incredible plays a role. Like it does in the movie, but other than that, I really don't remember what happened in the final level. Or how it's structured, I should say. Ah. I love when the flames hit me directly in the asshole. That's great. This is ridiculous. Thankfully, I didn't touch his health earlier, so I can just grab it now. Alright. definitely going to be over 30 minutes, but I don't care. I'm finishing this part. I'm finishing this level in this part. Just splitting this into two would... Yeah, it, it, it just not worth it. I was going to say, don't you dare miss. And thank God there isn't a second one. Final checkpoint, we're finally near the end of this. Really? You see me punch metal, and you still felt the need to get up and try to attack me. Man, either these guys are suicidal or they're the most loyal henchmen I've ever met. Or maybe both, who knows? What the? This is like some. This is like something Dr. Evil would make. Five million dollars. 
Really? How did I not get this guy? He was just as close as the other two. I'm constantly jumping just so that they can't get an easy lock. Why can't I pick you up and toss you away? And why are you still up? One more. Yes! Whew. I was hoping that the uh, cylinder would block the missile shot, and it did. Dang it! I just wanted a ride. There we go. I was like, let me latch you on. <laughs> Alright, please tell me the missile just about done. Why is it oh. Ah, come on, game. Ooh. Come on, come on, come on. Just need to get to the other side and it's over. Seriously? Dare hit me up the sky. <laughs> Success! Oh, okay, there's one last switch over there. There we go. Move, move, move. I do not give them a chance to shoot me up the sky. Haha! -ha! This has gotta be the end. Please tell me it's the end. Okay, I think that's the end of the level. Oh, thank God. I hated that one so much. Great! I can't fly, Rocket. Mm -hmm. You don't have to. Use the coordinates from the last launch. Ah, wait. I bet Syndrome's changed the password by now. How do I get into the computer? Stay oh. I'm definitely gonna need a little break after that whiplash. But second to last level, we're almost done. Stay tuned for the final part of The Incredibles. I'll see you guys then. Peace.